Welcome to Itrafi. In this video, I am going to explain this program. Write a C program to continuously take a number as input and announce whether the number is odd or even. Hint, use while loop, do while loop. That means uh, we have to take a number from user as input as long as the user want. Means we will have a menu like uh, press 1 to continue, press 0 to exit like that. And as long as the user want, user will input a number and we have to declare it whether it is odd or even. To do the program, first we need a editor. So we are opening code block. You can also do it in Visual Studio Code, Dave C, Turbo C or any other C cup editors. I am doing it on code block. So this is code block interface. Now we will take a new file, file, empty file. Here at first we have to write header file. So we'll write include and also we have to change the language into C. That if we change it then only we can see, uh, see the syntax highlighting. So include std io dot h. After that we need main function so int main then braces inside the braces we'll need variable to take the number so int n to take the number from user and we'll take one more variable choice and we'll take this number as 1 means here if user enter 0 we will exit from the program otherwise if user enter any other number we will take it as true means continue and we will continue to accept number from the user now we will write do means directly we will do something here we will write a printf statement and instead of printf we will write enter or number. After this, we'll have to read the numbers for that scanf and here percent d and m percent n because we are reading here n. Now we have to compare the number and declare whether it is odd or even for that if n module 2 equal 0 then here just uh, we'll write one statement in if if we are writing just one statement we can write without bracket but if we have to write uh, more than one statement we have to write inside brackets or blocks so as we are writing just one statement we'll not give any bracket directly we'll write printf statement and here we'll write that percentage d is even number slash n and here in place of d we are going to display the value of n but uh, while we write like this way we have to take care of this uh, indention means that space between if and this printf if we don't keep the space if we write uh, from same position then we'll have to give the bracket. Now else printf here we will write percentage d is odd number slash n after that n. Now we'll come out from the sorry now it's supposed to exit from the loop before exiting from the loop we'll ask the user question whether the user want to continue or not so we are going to write uh, take input for the choice so we'll write printf statement enter 0 to continue slash n 
any other number so here we will not write enter 0 to continue because uh, as per my planning I want that if the user enter 0 then I want to exit so we'll write enter 0 to exit and any other number to continue plus n now we'll read the value of choice so choice not directly choice scan it here we are reading integer so percent d and we'll store inside the value uh, variable choice now we'll come out from the loop and after that we are going to write while condition while here we'll write choice not equal zero means while choice is not zero at that moment it will do this program and here we'll write return zero so our program done now we'll have to run the program let's save the program first or even my program name save now we'll have to my program name will be odd even dot c first language c then file save is odd even dot c and here we'll select the file type as c language save now we are going to compile the program for compiling the program we'll click on this uh, build and run button after that here asking me to enter a number so we'll enter a number let the number be 3 3 is odd number and here I'm getting two options enter 0 to exit any other number to continue let the number be 3 I'm entering other than 0 so it will again continue enter a number now let it 8 8 is even number again let another number only 1 enter a number let be 0 0 is even number again any other number let be 2 enter a number now my number is 29 29 is odd number now if I enter 0 it will exit from the program so this way we can do this program you can see here this is the program I hope you have understood if any confusion write in comment section thank you for watching see you in a new video till then take care and bye